Hello guys, today I'm going to teach you how to combat c lock 3 to Rex 7 Online in Canon R8 in the series of Premiere Pro and CapCut PC. Let's go! This is a Canon website where you can get the official lock conversion in Canon R8. I will give in the link below, don't worry about it. So when you click, click the link I give in below, you will see this in Canon EOS R8 and Canon official website. You have to go to the software driver section and find Canon lookup table version. Then click download it. After we done it, the download, so you have to open it. Inside of the file, you will see so much much file. One delet is one dimensional, 3D is three dimensional. It's mean it's more depth. So we have to use highest the quality. 33 grid and 65 grid is not much much more different. But for the sake of the quality, we go through for 65 grid. If you want to convert to Rex 7 online, we have to know the what type of Canon lock we record. We record only in Canon Log 3, C Log 3. Okay, and then we want to convert it to Rex 7 online. So we have to find C Log 3 to me, this one BT 709 white DR65 ff version 2.0 and then what you have to do so go to the LUTs table find the LUTs we extract before and just click and drag and drop to the LUTs section in CapCut PC after we done drag and drop it to the CapCut PC find where is that LUT uh, this is the conversion of the c log 3 to Rex 7 or 9 in CapCut PC, you can just select in this LUT panel and drop to the above of the clip it will become uh, an adjustment layer like in Premiere Pro and just extend it to the right timeline or second method, you can go for the LUT here in the right panel in adjustment panel find that LUTs you add and drop before this one Cinema Game Mode can lock 3 to BT709 so after we done it we already convert it to Rec709 this is V4 this is after so we go to Premiere Pro let's go okay this is Premiere Pro this is one import file yes add and drop to the timeline and it will be here go to the windows workspace and go to the color we have go to the lumetri color panel go to the uh, creative browse some look we download it before cinema gamma can unlock 3 to bt709 what the r65 ff version 2.0 open it voila we already covered it to the proper proper combustion this is before this is after that's it for premiere pro okay here in St. Davin series of we have to drag that attach we oh i forget to tell you guys in the series of free it can't reach hvc format we need to encode it this video to dnr hqx so after we done it we have to drag this to the media pool in don't change media pool in the v series of and then we will try to drag this to the timeline in edit panel go to the color tab before that uh, effect color space transform and drag it to the node this is not we already know we use some cinema canon cinema gamuts in canon lock setting this is canon cinema gamut input gamma canon lock 3 for the output color space we will we always use rec 7 online for the output gamma just use timeline this is before this is after 
thanks for watching and i hope my i hope my tutorial will help you guys happy vacation and have a good time bye bye